Hi everyone! Today's inspiration look is Juliet Barnes of the character in Nashville, played by Hayden Penitary, and my model today, Brooke, who looks a lot like Hayden. Um, I'm doing the demo on her, and she's totally embracing Juliet Barnes' character. So, this is, I'm doing, I know Hayden wears a lot of different styles of makeup, but this one is definitely off her character in Nashville. And I get a lot of requests from a lot of girls, especially my students, and um, I've had people on YouTube as well inbox me and, and ask me to do this character. So what I did was I put a pearlized highlighting powder in the inner part of the eye to pull it out because Brooke's eyes tend to go in a little bit, so I want to open them up. And then I went under the, the brow bone. And now what I'm doing is I'm using more of, I'm doing a gradation, gradiated smoky eye, but very soft neutral. So I don't want this to have a heavy edge to it. So what I went, after I put the light pearl, I'm putting more of a warm pearl, as you can see. This one has a little bit of a smoky pearl to it, very lightly. So I'm using a very, uh, a, it's just a real straight brown with a gold shimmer, because I want, I was, you know, I'm looking at the, the character and she really does use a lot of shimmers and she really smokes, his, smokes her eyes out but she really stays also very kind of neutral glam. So I'm taking that brown kind of shimmer brown and I'm working the edge of the eye to see how I'm putting that in right on the edge of the eye. It's still very soft but with the light reflection and everything it really comes off really nice and you'll see how I build it up and I'm so I took the light from the highlighting and then the middle light and then now I'm using the soft brown and it's gradiating so it creates a nice gradation effect to the eyes and so see how I'm just working that on the edge and all the way into the middle crease and I'm pulling it out kind of like in a triangular shape so just do that and very subtly just very subtly you don't want to go overboard with this um, but it's just such a pretty look. I mean, Hayden Penitary is such a gorgeous girl. I mean, seriously, every no makeup, she looks gorgeous. So you really can't go wrong with, with her. But um, and and you know, I've been blessed to have a great model, Brooke, who looks a lot like her. And I told her just really channel in that character because she, she really has that similar look. So what I'm doing is I'm taking the same brown that I put on the outer edge of the upper. Um, lid and I'm just rimming the lash lower lash line with it as a liner just smoking it out a little bit see how it just picks it up like that so now I'm going with a very kind of chiffony orangey color cheek it's kind of a, got a creamy orangey look peachy I guess um, there's so many names to describe that and I'm just going right along her cheeks and I'm actually going to add a little bit more um, of this to the eyes as well. So see, I'm taking my blending brush and I'm going right on the inner crease. And see how that is? It just, just gives it a pickup and it kind of pulls the whole face together. Sort of a trick of the trade. And, thing, and this is now like a shimmery peachy color that I'm putting right on the top of the lid just to add reflection. So this is a really cool trick. And then I'm going to also just give that a nice blend all over the face and see how it just gives it a little pick up. Now this is another trick. I'm just going to add black, black, black mascara. And this really will add the payout to the, the rimming of the eyes. Instead of putting a liner, the black really, really will bring the eyes out really. And especially because Brooke has such beautiful blue eyes, so does Pay uh, Hayden Penitary. And so the black, and I'm using a very thick, clump, like really thick lash formula. So don't, you know, use the thin, use a thick, more, not just volumizing, but more thickening lash. Because I think it's really great. And you can put la la um, individual lashes as well. I mean, you can definitely put a, a strip liner as well. But I think you want to still keep it very neutral, natural. Um, but yeah, if you want to learn any of these techniques, definitely go to mkcbeautyacademy.com. You can take the online um, education, which is fantastic. 
and also you can also do the certification if you want to really go for the pro. You can also take private lessons with me. You can also do a blended and that's more really cost saving as well. So definitely go to www.mkcbeautyacademy.com and click on all the different classes and you'll learn all my tricks of the trade and definitely I can also customize a learning plan for you. So this is a really great way and these YouTube videos help inspire you if you are a, a, a an aspiring makeup artist who want to really go for it in the industry and I'll definitely give you as much as I can to help you get your success okay so this is my last thing so I'm taking like three steps lighter brown and this has more shimmer than brown actually and I'm just taking my blending brush and I'm going right underneath that other brown that I put and this just kind of opens it up and smolders it out a little bit gives it a little bit of smoke and see how pretty that that effect is Okay, so now I'm going to take a very neutral, kind of mauve beige, but more sheer glimmer lip gloss, and I'm going to put that over her lips, and I want to keep it very clean and very neutral, because I want the eyes to really come out, and the Hayden Penitentiary's uh, makeup in the show, she definitely goes from neutral, and she'll definitely do red lips, she'll do big hair, she'll pull the hair back, I mean, she's really flexible but you know she definitely stays with that kind of country singer effect I heard that Hayden Penetary I mean correct me if I'm wrong but I heard that she is um, actually um, inspired by Carrie Underwood so that makes sense Carrie Underwood's really beautiful they have very similar features and that's it so thanks so much for watching if you want more please you know inbox me make comments subscribe, like, share, but definitely stay tuned. I have tons more coming. Thanks a lot, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.